Hi guys, this is Shiva Reddy. Welcome to the Git Tutorials. In this session, I am going to explain different type of file status while working with the Git. So this is a more of a theoretical session. In the next couple of tutorials, you can see all this through the practical. But uh, at high level, when you are working with the, any files through the Git, you will see these are the status you can uh, you can see while working with the Git. The first one is once you copy the data from the server to your local that is called as a working copy once once you got the working copy you can add few more files to the local working copy those files we will call as a untracked files that means those are newly added to the working space work, workspace or the local working directory is called as an untracked files once you add once you apply git add command on those um, untracked files those become staged are the new files once you stage those files these the staged files are the files which are going to be part of the next commit now when you use the git command git commit command then those files will be part of the those files will be part of the going to be part of the commit and those now will become the unmodified now these are the unmodified files are the files are the files which is going to be uh, not changed that means the fix is going to be um, permanent and similarly whenever unmodified is a file for example you got the clone of the data now what you done is you have edited the existing file then the file will become the modified once the file is become modified you have to add that file to the again staging area using the git add, uh, add command once you add this file that will become the modified or the staged file now when you use the git command then this will again will be going for the unmodified unmodified the files are the files which is going to be rep uh, which is going to be um, stored as part of the main repository when you use the push command and next one is unmodified is the file um, now let us consider you have the local working copy now you have removed the file from the working copy now that will the status become deleted so these are the status of the files when you working with the git hope this concept is clear let us see if you have any